meteorologist Lynette Charles, who always keeps that thermostat down <laughs> below 68 <laughs> in her home. My bill is so high, I swear <laughs> I'm paying for my neighbor's stuff. Like, oh my gosh, I could not even. All right, satellite and radar. We do have some rain out there right now already, and if you're not getting wet yet, take the rain gear with you because we do have some wet weather on the way, especially as we go towards the afternoon. Another push of it just in time, unfortunately, for your commute home today. So around 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock, we'll start to see more rain coming in, but we'll even get more rain showers before that happens as well. So just like we had last week where we had the off and on showers across the area, that's how it's going to be uh, pretty much this week, minus the severe weather that we saw on your Friday. So that's definitely some good news. The satellite and radar zoomed in, and you can see the, the light rain happening around Cockeysville this morning up through I-83 if you're going to be crossing the border into Pennsylvania. Also now we're seeing the wet weather around Harford County. So Bel Air embedded some moderate rain coming in between Bel Air and Dublin at this point. Abingdon, you're getting in on this wet weather as well. We widen out the view and you can see this is the round that's with us right now, but then we have all that rain back off towards the west, down off towards the south, and that's going to be making its push in here as we go through the rest of today. If you're traveling to the north, you are going to be running into some snow across that area. So just to take it easy, give yourself enough time. Uh, if you're going out of an airport, you might want to call ahead and see how if you have any type of delays or anything. Temperature wise this morning, if we got anything in here, of course it was going to be rain. That's what we're seeing this morning as these temperatures are well above freezing at this point. It's 42 degrees right now in Pasadena Highland Beach. Good morning to you. You're at 44 degrees. Upper 30s, 39 degrees in Hereford this morning. We're seeing that in Westminster as well. Across the eastern shore, 40s in Millington and also around Goldsboro, 41 in Chestertown. 45 degrees right now in Ocean City and Deep Creek's coming in right around 36 degrees there. Futurecast going to go into motion for you, picking up on that rain that we'll see about 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock. Again, that push for your commute home is going to be a wet one out there, so prepare for that. And this is what we look like as we head towards Tuesday. We'll do it all over again. It looks like the heaviest rain will stay more off to the south of us, but we will get in again some uh, embedded heavier rain coming in across the area as we head towards your Tuesday morning as well. So rain gear needed today, rain gear needed as we work our way into your Tuesday as well. And then we'll start to see some changes as we head towards the end of the work week into the weekend. But if you're looking at that spring countdown, 38 days until spring. So we're getting closer and closer. A lot of you happy about that. But also remember, springtime will bring in what we saw on Friday. That's when we start to get the clashing of the air masses and we'll have more severe weather at that point as well. Here's a seven day forecast for you as we see those temperatures in the upper 50s as we head towards your Thursday.